morning everyone. Just make sure that's set up right. Uh, so it's Saturday morning, it's quarter past four. Um, we're out in the truck again. Sorry there wasn't any last week. Uh, they, they just didn't need me. Um, let's try and get to turn this down a bit. Uh, so we just got one drop today, it was supposed to be two originally, now we're just down to one, we're off to um, Hemel Hempstead, uh, just give me two seconds, I just need to move the seat over. Perfect, uh, just so we can see out of the, uh, the door. Mirror, oh, sorry, out of the door mirror, out of the area. So we can see out there, we fold the seat up. So we can do that. Um, yeah, so looks like I'm on my way to Hemel Hempstead. It's getting still already. Uh, all my safety checks are done, load secured, it's all checked over. Um, so yeah, we're about to hit the road. So I'll uh, I'll check all check in. Oh, pardon me. I will check in with you all uh, a bit later on.
Morning everyone. Uh, right, so I've just got to Hemel Hempstead. Um, the other truck, uh, it wasn't a bad run down actually in fairness. It's very straightforward. I don't think I came up against any traffic. So it was a straight blast through to be honest. That's why I mean it's what, uh, just before 10 to seven. So it made, made a really good time. Um, uh, I think we might be slightly early because the other lorry, which is the full lorry, um, they haven't even emptied one side yet. So I reckon I've probably got a good half hour wait, I reckon, give or take. Um, so I'm just grabbing, uh, putting, just put it on to break, 15 minute break for a while. Um, so yeah, so uh, hope everyone's well. Um, and had a good week. Uh, my week hasn't been too bad in fairness. Um, obviously like I said, I, I wasn't driving last weekend uh, for the dairy. Uh, I mean this weekend, I mean next weekend as well. So there should be a, a steady stream of content now for that um, it works just been uh, a little bit busy a bit of coffee love the nice coffee get a hot drink later once we're uh, once we're being unloaded um, so yeah uh, out in one of the newish trucks today uh, registration ending GUD. I will put some pictures up in a bit for that one. Mm, nice express espresso one. It's quite nice actually. Um, but yeah, so we haven't. We really don't have a lot on here. Uh, I think we're about uh, half a trailer. Just over half a trailer. I think there's the 13 pallets, I think. I think I remember seeing on the paperwork. Um, but yeah, so originally, um, today, I was gonna have the two drops like I did previously, where it would have been a Hemel Hempstead overspill and um, Kent Dairies. Um, Kent Dairies was only ever going to be one pallet. Um, but apparently uh, they were able to get it in, I guess, yeah, in the original, in the first truck that's had the stuff in there. So, um, so apparently obviously that meant that we didn't need to, uh, didn't need to go and do that one. good um, I mean it wouldn't matter to me I, I mean I quite like doing these two runs it's only about 20 20 something minutes away from here so it's exact I don't think it's that long it's not far from here anyway um, but uh, yeah so that that's kind of the shortened my day a little bit, it probably has shortened it a little bit. Um, but uh, yeah, just just chilling really now, just waiting for, uh, <laughs> waiting for this guy to be emptied. They've just emptied the one side, they're just putting empties back on, uh, but they got to empty the other side, so it's going to be a bit of a while yet. Yeah. So yeah, I'll go try and get some the pictures of the truck as well. Uh, what's in here? Sorry about the drumming away you can hear, but that's obviously the fridge. Keeping the milk cold. Um, obviously we always try to leave it on when we're, you know, when, you know before we get it delivered, we, we leave them on as much as we can. Uh, luckily we're not around a housing estate, so if we was 
then obviously we'd turn it off uh, but we're not around a housing estate around here so it's just a giant industrial park so yeah so I'm gonna um, I'll probably grab a bit of food I think we'll see right well I'm gonna uh, go and enjoy my coffee wait for the wait for them to be unloaded and uh, I'll catch you all soon Hello everyone, so I thought I'd give you a quick uh, tour inside the back. Like I said, we're about half full. Uh, yeah, so like I say, we don't have a lot in here. Um, all the paperwork. So yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So we've got uh, 13, like they all have curtains as uh, netted. Just moving the nets down. So we go. Uh, yeah, so like I say, just half. So uh, yeah, literally half the trailer. So, uh, shouldn't be very long today. So we're gonna be back on the road. Try and give you a quick uh and then around on the outside. Once I can get out. Funny if I fall now, wouldn't it? Stage doors. <laughs> Don't know how much I actually saw that. Hello, so I'm now being tipped. Um like I said, I've only got half like half a trailer on, so yeah, well we're not gonna be here long at all. Um and then I just need to get the last half hour of my break in. Um There's a nice little lay by actually not far from here, so what I'll probably do is pull out of here. She can't no Sometimes you can park on the edge of the road over here just before you turn in. Not always, uh, so we'll see. If we can get there, maybe we'll get there. If we can't, then we'll just go around to the lay-by and pull up there for half hour. Um, but yeah, so we're, we're just being tipped. Guys, very nicely got me a coffee. Second coffee of the day. Oh, good. Um, yeah. So, <laughs> the day's going really well. Um, I do like this, uh, like I said, I've said many times, I do like this uh, this run. Uh, I did try, I made a massive rookie error. So I decided, I thought, well, what I'll do is I'll put the GoPro on the outside of the driver's window, this side. And I put it on the outside, but I didn't clean the window. So I came out, no. I got out of the cab, I went, went for a wee, came back, and then realised the GoPro and the thing was on the floor. Also, I found out that it, it did, the memory card had jumped out the thing, 
So I eventually found that on the floor as well. So, um, yeah, I, I'm sure it will work on the outside, but I was only going to do it for manoeuvring purposes. And in fairness, it's pulling forward about 10 metres. So realistically, it wasn't achieving much. Um, so, yeah, just waiting for them to unload me from here. I think I've only got two more pallets left to come off. And um, then door pull curtains. Uh, I'm dead sure I'm going back empty anyway. Um, then a nice, nice trip back. Um, weather's not too bad. Thought it might have been a bit sunnier. A bit cloudy, but it's telling me it's dry. I'm not going to complain, it is dry. I normally get this job when it's wet. And that's why I'm... Uh, yeah, a little surprise sometimes because it's, it's not nice when it's wet. The water's running straight off. That's why I'm going to try and get some new gloves. Better gloves, anyway. Because uh, the water runs down the curtain. And obviously, because you're doing the ratchet up, the water runs down your sleeve. Mine aren't with waterproof gloves, so they get wet. And then you end up with wet gloves. Because as much as you try to dry them, they, they won't dry out in time. So, Right, well, I'm going to go and see how they're going on. And then see if I can start doing up the curtains. So I can get back on the road. I'll uh, probably catch you all in my uh, in my break. Hello everyone, right that's just had my break, just going around doing all my checks. A lovely little lay-by in Hamel Hempstead. around here. Right, go back in the truck. Huh. 
probably hear me better now. Just get the old girl wound back up and uh, we'll get ready to hit the road. I do a bit of a different angle. Um, here. Don't get around this car. Keep speeding up, slowing down, speeding up, slowing down. I know you're not going to move over, are you? Mate, come on! really do my head in. I wish I'd have caught that on camera. So that car has literally sat in the middle lane, waiting for me to overtake, and then has gone, no. Uh, no. You're a lorry and you're not going past. He's just sat there now in the middle lane. He's sat in between two of us, two lorries. So infuriating. Anyway, going back to where he was. So we're just travelling back on the M4, uh, weather's not too bad actually, there's sudden bursts of sun, that's the reason I've got my glasses on top of my head. Oh, you know, 
I, I enjoy trucking. Uh, I love it on a Saturday as well uh, because it's early enough in the morning that you you get to beat a lot of the traffic. The only real time you're in traffic is on the way back. everyone right well I do have um, an apology to make because I did promise that I'd try and get some recording around the yard however even though I didn't record an awful lot of the way back to try and preserve some battery the battery died so I thought, well, that's fine, I've got a third battery. It's not a problem, hook it in. I have lost that third battery. It was in the box earlier, and now it's gone. 
and I don't know where because I have not took it out of the cab. I've searched the cab, it's not there. So annoyingly, I didn't get anything around the yard. But in fairness, I wasn't really in the yard long. I mean, from getting back there, I think I was there about 15 minutes. I was in and out, like, um, so I do have to apologize for that. So I'm deeply sorry. Um, yeah, so we, like I said, we got back, um, just had to fuel it. They wanted it re uh, reversed into the bay, which was annoying because I wish I could have recorded that. Might have been a bit awkward to do it in fairness, but it would have been nice to have done it. Um, and then hook, just had to hook it up to trailer 75, I think it was. And uh, that, that was done. I was going to just... So yeah, that was uh, that was that was my day. Um, as I said, I'm back in next uh, next Saturday, four o'clock, I believe, unless that changes. Um, I'm actually in front of one of our tank. Uh, I, one of the tankers is in front of me. I think it's one I actually went out in as well. Um, it was quite cool driving the tankers. A bit different very different to drive in because you've got rear steer and stuff like that as well but anyway that's going back to going back. so uh, yeah one easy drop today uh, weather was good as well traffic wasn't too bad brought me back on the m4 um the, the only bit of traffic really was very the a the a419 to the a417 not the normal place it was literally the hot air balloon roundabout round there car just went straight through a red light um uh so yeah that that, that knocked us back about 22 minutes or so um so in fairness we would have finished even earlier we'd probably been finished by 12 um it's just before half past 12 so but yeah it, uh, it's been a good day. I, I quite enjoy that one. Um, I've got this feeling that I'm on four o'clock next week. It's probably going to be the same. They obviously don't know at this point because well, it's way, way in advance. But normally, uh, they would normally start me at five. But I think because they've said four, I think that's going to be uh, Hemel again. Might be Hemel and but either way, you know, one or the other. Um, so, yeah, M5 doesn't look too bad actually. Fairly clear. It is good. I'm just about to join the M5. Um, feels like a, an early finish, but in fairness, I had an early start. I started at quarter four, so it, um, I don't know if technically that's technically classed as an early finish. <laughs> it's still a still a what eight eight and a half hour shift. So let's hopefully someone will let me on. So, hope everyone has a, a nice weekend. Weather's supposed to be quite nice. Um, so, I mean, what we know, it says 18 degrees. I don't quite agree with that. I don't think it's that warm. But anyway, um, so yeah, so I'm going to hopefully go and try and enjoy some of that. Um, thank you for everyone that's subscribing uh, to the channel. Like I say, it, it's leveled off quite a lot now. Um, so, I've got to try and find something new to get new people in. Um, if you could, you know, like in the video and comment in, that's great. Because, you know, I'm just serving the same content, but I don't know if that's what you guys prefer. If you want something different. Um, I tried to cover a lot more today, see if I can, if that changes any of the viewings. Um, like I say, all this will be edited tonight 
and will be uploaded uh, tonight, hopefully, done overnight, uh, ready for 5.30pm tomorrow. Um, like I say, I know there's been a bit of a, a delay, because obviously last week I wasn't at, uh, at the dairy. I wasn't doing anything last week in fairness, it was nice to have a weekend off. Um, so, the next weekend, next day I'm back in. So. And then I think the weekend after that, I'm back in. But there's only one weekend I said I can't do, I think it's the 10th of May. 11th of May, 10th of May is Friday. The 11th of May. But apart from that, you know, we're, we're good. I mean, I quite enjoy doing them, so that's, that's great for me. Right, well, uh, like I say, I'm just on the M5, so I'm not far from home now. Um, thank you all for watching. Please, like I said, like and subscribe, drop us a comment. J just introduce yourself, that's, you know, and I'll probably try. If, I, if you guys can introduce yourself, I can give you a shout out on the next video. Um, so please, like I say, drop your name in the in the comment section on YouTube. Um, I'll try and get all the images uploaded as well. And uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, and I will uh, I'll see you all again soon. Bye guys.